everybody. I'm Dave McClellan, and welcome to Firebird Raceway. First off, Al Hoffman at the 93 Motocraft Ford Nationals in Phoenix. In the blink of an eye, Hoffman's car goes from race winner to a rolling inferno with Al in the cockpit surrounded by flame. Unable to see, much less stop the car, Hoffman travels into the desert past the end of the track, his vehicle hopelessly engulfed in a raging fire. From the finish line, we see the engine let go just as he streaks across a head of force. A valve hangs, filling the cylinder with fuel. The piston can't compress the unburnt fuel and kicks a hole in the block. Hot oil gushes from the cracked engine and ignites on the white hot headers, all in a fraction of a second. And now is when seconds really count. Al must steer clear of the wall, stay out of the other competitor's lane, bring his burning race car to a stop, and exit the wreckage before he's overcome from the heat and smoke. Here you can see the exploded engine pieces and parts racing along ahead of the fiery hulk as it slides fully involved in the flame to the end of the track. And not unlike the Phoenix, Al Hoffman rises from the ashes of his race machine. He suffered some superficial burns, a little smoke inhalation, but was otherwise unhurt. After the horrible fire in Phoenix, do you put that out of your mind completely when you get near that finish line? Are you holding your breath or anything like that? Nah, that was years ago. Uh, it was only a week. Two weeks ago. Right. Seems like years ago now.